Great photograph. Yeah, the great lighting and all that. Great like, lighting. But it's not the like, photograph. We're it's not, not the photograph. The photograph. Like, we're not going to say anything negative about photos, but if there's a good one, can we yeah. say it's good? We can it's, say it's good. It's good. This it's is great. A good. This is yeah. a great photo, but yeah. this is not a great site. And you know what? This is a very good photographer. Yeah. I guess that's her right there. So, Mylene, here's what I would recommend. Start from scratch. So, like, you got a great shot here, and then the next shot down. This is a great shot. These are great shots. I would like to see those big and bold. and Because you know what happens? Yeah, this is when, designed to scroll, too. And a lot Yeah, of this is just the, a long, yeah. scrolly. And it just, it really has a dated look to it. Like, even the font. Like, it's time to create a logo, an actual logo. It's just the whole thing just feels kind of dated. And you, when you think of the impact... And, and that's what it is. Like, if, if I'm going to hire you for something, I want to go, and before I ever click on anything, I want to I think, wow, she's really good. Like, I, I wonder if I can afford her. Perfect. And let's good. look at the galleries. Oh, when you hit galleries, it just takes you down the page, and then I guess you have to click again. Oh, Mylene. And then you have really nice yeah, pictures. It's a WordPress site. That's why I figured it's a WordPress. Yeah. Uh, yikes! I mean, but that's what. There's nothing wrong with WordPress, but that's the one thing about WordPress is WordPress is the. I feel like this, and this is what I felt like. This is like a. They kind of laid out like a company site would be. I imagine that you already subscribe to one of Adobe's platforms. Go to adobe.portfolio.com and go build a nice portfolio. You can have it up and running tonight. You already have all the pictures, but. Big and bold and easy to get around. How about, oh, here's a nice one. Guys, look at the impact of that shot. Look at that. Yeah, when how big it is. you see these shots, they're big and they take over the screen and they they just get you. They just get you. Look at that. That's a great shot, and too. Now, this is a Smug Bug site. I can tell it's a yep, Smug Bug site. Yep, because it says Smug now, Bug up in the left to, corner. What you need to go through is your settings in Smug Bug. And, and there's turn a little off the button logo. where you can turn off that logo. You yeah, can that logo right can, can go away. So just go through your settings, and you can yeah. turn off that logo. Right. And there's just a little link. But this looks nice. And if I click on Portfolio, Eric, is it going to scroll down the page, to, or is it just going to take me to his portfolio? Look, here it is again. Nice big like i don't have to now each one of these is going to be another portfolio unto itself right, right? right. but let's look at the air show images just Not because like we like air shows oh that's nice yeah it's good stuff. hey i have a shirt with this on it right there just that part the green and i made i made yeah. my own shirt uh nice aviation shots very nice oh yeah look at that oh yeah nice nice yeah, the photography is great and it's big and it's impactful also, I would just say this, Stephen, you have your logo that says Stephen's Outdoor Photography, and then you write it again. Stephen's Outdoor Photography. Yeah, just take that out. You take that big one out and just put your logo right there. Or put that there and get rid of your logo. But there's no sense in saying yeah, Stephen's Outdoor like Photography. Double, double work. And then, and then, and then well, don't put your you've got the there? website. Where I'm at They're your website. Your website so I'm don't the, put the website don't on Don't put that. your website. I'm at your website. Yeah, just don't put it on. Yeah, there. okay. You can clean this up a little bit. Agreed. Okay. All right. All right. Let's yeah, take a look at. A, let's take a look at another one. Ooh. Two thousand called. They want their. They want their template back. What? Is, do, yeah, you know what this looks like is. The, remember the old Apple, like Apple websites. What was it called? Oh yeah. Like me dot com. Here's another really good photographer, with a really bad portfolio website. Linda. You're better than that, Linda. Yeah, Linda, you Linda. got some nice shots. Linda, let's see them big and let's, you know. And also, you could probably get down to one sentence here. You could just move that last line here and just make it one thing. But these pictures, you've got some really good shots that would be really impactful, really, really large. And then you got the same shot. This shot. Is the same shot here. I just saw this one. Yeah, try to vary it. Yeah, you got the skills. You got to get the website. Yeah, this this long scrolling site's kind of meh. What happens right. on portfolio? Yeah. Let's go look at portraits. So it's the same things that were below. Got it. Yeah, it's the same topics. That's cool. No one's going to read all that text. Yeah, you can almost reverse that. Make the portraits the lead. Yeah. Now, your, your thumbnails here aren't bad because they're at least big enough to where 
Yeah, you could they you could see them. Yeah. Clearly. 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 18 19 20 21 22 23 24. That's that's not too bad. Mm-hmm. It seemed like a lot when I was scrolling through. We'll figure it this way. Let's say oh, that you man. took out the six weakest ones. It'd get that much better. Especially since like you got the same guy in here twice. Yeah, maybe that's one of the things too with the portfolio is uh, trying not to repeat the same look so it yeah. becomes obvious. Yeah. So the this inside page is way better except for all this text. Well, yeah, the, if you reverse the inside. The, now yeah. this would be good on like you know an about me page, which is very very important yeah, in these times. Yeah, let's a meet me page. Like is that an about me page? Yeah. So that's kind of like the about me page. Yeah, well that's fine. So maybe putting more of that information there. Yeah, move some of that salesy stuff there. And I want to look at your sports portraits just because I like sports portraits. Just listen. But see, I think, like, look at these. These are nice, big. These are well done. Oh, these are really good, actually. These are these are better than well done. These are, these are good. These are, you're smoking it. All right. Yeah, but then imagine those pictures in like the first couple sites we saw where they were really right, big. Right, they were they really big, impact. right? Like this is like a pro shot. Yeah. yeah. I want to see them big. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, so maybe that's what it is. It's just again just increasing that size and, and decreasing like let the image sell your site yeah. and then let the copy be something people seek out. Cuz at the end of the day that's what they're going to hire you about, you know, or there are your images exciting is that the kind of images that they want. 